Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the condenser fan motor in your refrigerator, be sure to unplug the power cord. You will need to pull the refrigerator away from the wall so you can access the rear of the appliance. To do this, use a Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the screws, securing the base grill. Pull the base grill forward to remove. Use a quarter inch socket or wrench to rotate the brake feet counterclockwise to raise them. You can now roll the refrigerator away from the wall. Use the quarter inch socket or a nut driver to unthread the screws to release the rear access panel. For easier access to remove the condenser fan motor, you can uninstall the motor mounting bracket. First detach the front of the drain tube from the grommet. Now pull the wire bundle out from under the lip of the bracket. Next, move the top of the mounting bracket to the right, then lift the front bracket pin out of the base. You can now maneuver the rear bracket pin out of the base. Depress the tab to disconnect the wire connector. Use the quarter inch socket or nut driver to unthread the mounting screws to release the old motor. Prepare the new condenser fan motor for installation by transferring the fan blade from the old motor to the new one. Align the new motor on the bracket and thread the mounting screws. Connect the wire connector. If applicable, reinstall the mounting bracket by first inserting the rear pin in the base. Align the front pin, then lock the top of the bracket into place. Reposition the drain tube over the grommet. Tuck the wire bundle under the motor mounting bracket. Reposition the access panel and rethread the screws. Once the refrigerator has been moved back into place, Rotate the brake feet clockwise until both are in contact with the floor. Snap the base grill into place. Rethread the screws to secure the base grill. Plug the power cord back in, and your refrigerator should be ready for use.